Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Welcome back to another Woods. <laughs> woods. Woods. <laughs> Welcome back. You know what game it is. And I have to go get myself an Alpha Axe. Oh, gosh. That is super loud, isn't it? I am so sorry. It's insane how loud that is. All right, we gotta we gotta fix that. Oh, are you buying all all of those? I don't think it's only gonna work for me for one because I didn't I didn't touch the other two. So that's that's your bad. Hi, buddy. What's going on? Oh my gosh. Wow, <laughs> you're just out there. Wow, that's a lot of rainbows. A lot of rainbows. Oh goodness. Okay, that is not my car. Is that my car? Is this my car? That's my car. Oops. Sorry. 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 Uh, I had a couple of concerns. A couple of people being um, picky <laughs> about the uh, the development of the game. Styling was one of them. Somebody was saying it's like very inconsistent. I'm like it doesn't matter. It's fun to play. I don't. I don't care. I don't care. Um, next was something about the uh, the trees going in backwards to a sawmill. This is not my base. Hold on. Where did my base go? Is that my base? <gasps> Have you seen my base? There it is. Yeah. Yeah. There it is. Yeah. Okay, so it's true. You can put in trees backwards through the sawmill, but here's the thing. It still will not sawmill them out if it's over 30 units long. Like this, this right here, if the total of all the models does not equal 30, it will not sawmill. Like, hold on. Can we turn all these backwards for just a second? Oh, that is backwards. Nice. Maybe that's why I was having the the glitch earlier. Oh, we got one more turn backwards up here. And one more. I can't get it through the trees. Hold on. Oh, oh. Nope. Cancel. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now the whole thing should go backwards. Come on, come on, get in there. Notice how it's not planking. Okay. I'll take off some of this. Come on. Maybe. All right. Are we under 30? There it goes. It has to be under 30 units. Oh, it redid the thing. <laughs> nice. So the videos that you were sending me about the uh, person putting in the, the logs backwards, it's, it's not really a bug. You can do that. You can put in the logs backwards. It seems weird that you can do that, but it's not a concern because there's still a maximum of 30 units or 60 units, something like that, for each one of the sawmills. Like, you can only put in 30 at a time. It's impossible to get a big tree to drop in there. Even the, the glitch that's still on LT2, Lumber Tycoon 2, uh, you can chop down an entire elm tree, stick one portion of it into the, um, the sell-off point, and if it breaks off a small piece of that tree, leave the rest of the tree there and plank out that one piece and you can get the entire tree. Like the tree will be down by the drop off cell point. You put it through and the entire tree will plank. So, I mean, that you can't do in here. We've got that fixed as well. There's a, there's a bunch of little nuances that are fixed and still a lot of bugs. Oh my gosh. Are you okay, Meredith? Oh, hi. <laughs> there's lots of people. Oh my goodness. I wasn't really going to like do too much of anything today, 
but that was definitely one thing I wanted to show off. So, uh, the next, what was it? It was the, the grippy tires. Somebody was talking about grippy tires and I didn't know what they were talking about until I saw another video that was posted and I, I thought I'd come over here and show this to you. It's kind of cool. I wanted to see if I could get the trucks to ride the wall because it, it relies on the tires touching the ground. Hmm. Hold on. Let's see if we can do this. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Okay. Um, that was not what I meant to do. Um, okay. Drop. So if you didn't know this little trick, push, push, push. Oh, come on. Wrong side. Wrong side. Get back. Get back to the other side. Break on through to the other side. What happened? Did it go stuck? Ah! <laughs> okay. There we go. Get out of the, get out of the truck. Now, if I use this, I push. There we go. Come on, come on. So close. It worked better when I had it in the back of the truck. Come on. Oh, <laughs> spinny axe. Push, push, help. Oh, oh, oh. There we go, there we go. Oh no. Oh, I'm teetering on the edge. I'm on the edge. Oh gosh. Come on, come on. Just a little further. <laughs> yeah, bump me. Bump me. Hold on, can I just push? Push, 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 push. Ah. Uh, all right. <laughs> Both of us have the same idea. Ready? Lift. Lift. Lift and push. Lift and push. Lift and push. Uh. <sighs> Lift, push. There it goes. Nice. I don't know what I'm doing. It's there's nowhere I can go from here. So, all right, let's put that under here. And if I lift, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, lift. You can do it. <laughs> It's not working. It's not working at all. <sighs> you know what? It's fine. It's fine. We'll just walk this way then. We'll walk along the cliffs and the mountainside. And just enjoy the, the music and the scenery around us. Everything being a hexagon. It's a hexagon, right? Steven? Hexagon? Hexagon. Yeah. Zunk. <clears throat> Or is it pint? Okay, Google. How many sides does a hexagon have? Six. How many sides does... Hey, Google. How many sides does a pentagon have? Okay, it says working on... Okay, Google. How many sides does a pentagon have? Really? Come on. Get out of there. It's five. It's a pentagon. Oh, wait. Oh, that's an arch. Ooh, what's this? Hi. Hi. Anything over here? I don't think there's anything over here. And void death gets rid of your axes, doesn't it? 
We. Yeah, I don't see anything under there. Oops, you died. Yep, I'll teleport. No axe. No axe. I don't think a void death should uh, get rid of your axes. Because what if somebody gets flung for some reason, you know? You don't want to have them losing their axes for no reason. <clears throat> we should talk about that for the developers. Anyhow, I think that's it. That's that's pretty much all I had today was just showing the uh, the grippy tires. And I think it's more just friction on the tire itself. I don't think it's actually... <clears throat> I don't think it's... Traction based. Well, I guess friction would be traction based. Wouldn't it? Um, can I open this? I am a developer, right? Can I can I come in, please? Cannot do the uh, that glitch anymore either. Come on, grab, grab. Nope. Is that a basic hatchet or is that a golden hatchet? Golden axe. I don't think that's a gold axe. It's a little cactus tree, though. It's cute. And there's a duck and a cube. I don't know what the cube is, though. So, we're going to have something over there. Definitely. Oh, there is something. Hold on. I don't know exactly where it's at. Hold on a second. Let's see here. I might have to go get myself a long plank to do this. Yeah, we're going to need a long plank. Hold on. I'm actually going to get to use that oak tree I demonstrated earlier. That's awesome. So, uh, to long plank, we're going to go all the way down. Down, to down, 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 down. We want the X on point eight and the Y as low as we can get it. Also, shouldn't this be XZ coordinates? X Z, not X Y. Just saying. Roblox terms, not mine. Oh, come on. It's stuck. It's stuck again. <clears throat> okay. Yes, silly. Get in there. <sighs> All right. Drop this down like that. Move. Grab. Thank you. Whoa. Dude. Long planks in this game are no joke. Just saying. Is it going to hit that tree? No, it'll go around it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is it done? I think it's done. Can I grab it? No, it's not done. Oh yeah, yeah, it's done. Unstable. Unstable as all get out. Okay. I don't have an axe. All right, uh, hold on. I gotta go buy an axe. Okay, totally just went and bought myself an axe. <coughs> <coughs> so, let's go ahead and duplicate this end. Jeez. Okay. So, this is going to be my long plank. Maybe not. Wow. Okay, let's make it a little bit shorter. This. Okay. Wow. Wow. Seriously, wow. All right. Okay. So it kind of fit on the truck. Not really. I'm going to try and drive with it. <laughs> wow. There's no way. Oh, gosh. Yeah, there's there's no way to stably move this thing along. So I'm, I'm going to have to walk all the way over there with it. Okay. So I got about halfway there, but I don't think this is where it's at. We have to keep going. This is just one of the middle rocks here. 
so yep it's not here it's not up there I think it's right over in this area but I've got to go find it because I completely don't remember where it's at dev trying to look like hoofer who is that is that noob no I don't know who that is Yoink. Flip. Oh, skills. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try and flip this around and go down the other opposite side. Alright, hold on. Alright, we should be on the way. So right there is the way to get up to the mountain where the uh, lumberman statue is. So if you come straight across to this side of the rocks, there should be a secret. Okay, I think I got to the right spot, maybe. I'm gonna walk up there and see. So if you wanna take a look around, right there's the way to go up to the mountains. Uh, right over there's the stores. It's just in a little corner on this base. So, <clears throat> here we go. Oh, by the way, you don't have to have just one person on here. Hmm. Doesn't look like he's over here. So, might he be one more up? Come on, noob. Come on, buddy. Hi, Danny boy. Come on, come on, yeah. Oh, 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 careful, <laughs> he walked under it. <sighs> no, 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 don't walk under it, there you go. I don't know if you're gonna be able to jump that, but I, I know I'm not gonna be able to grab it. You got this, you got this, you got this. There you go, buddy. All right, let's see if I can grab it. <sighs> oh, man. Oh, it's unstable. It's unstable. It's so unstable. Oh, geez. Now, I think I only need the long one for that, right? Ooh, did it go through? <clears throat> here, I should be able to chop it off right here. That'll make this a little bit more stable. And we don't need to go quite as high up this time. So... Come on back, come on back, come on back, and drop. Oh, 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 careful, careful. Oh, come back down. Grab. Wah. Oh no, oh no. Oh, don't hit, don't hit, don't hit the sides. Come back, come back, come back. Slowly. Slow, 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 slow. Oh, there we go. Okay. Got a little land bridge for us to walk across. Or a little little wood bridge. Oh. Okay. We'll check this side real quick. See if it's here. If not, we'll go up over to the opposite side. All right. And... This will be a quick one. Switch over to this side. And come on, come on, come on. Drop. There we go. Bam. Oh, I don't see him. Um, of course, he might have been uh, grabbed in this one already. Uh, you can't pick him up with the, the normal grab, but you can use trees to knock him down. Or you can use long planks or axes to like push them around. But there's a little nymph guy. There's a little tree dude that uh, is up here in the mountains. And um, shout out to who was it? Morgs? I think Morgs was the one that sent that to me. So Morgs and Zoe, shout out to you for finding the, uh, the nymph. N-Y-P-H, Nymph, N-Y-M-P-H, Nymph. 
It's got to be over here somewhere, right? Not in there. I could have sworn he was over in this little corner right here. Maybe not. Maybe he's somewhere else. Or maybe he spawns at random. Is that possible? Is it possible he spawns at different areas? Or I just, I'm just looking at the wrong area, aren't I? Hmm. Okay. Let me pause for a second. I'm going to go check something. Okay, so here is... Here is him. This was him actually like finding it in that little tree guy right there in the center. That's him. So he found it right over here like that. So that's morgues. Uh, right there, uh, I'm pointing to the screen like you can see it. Um, hold on, can I show cursor properties? Clip area, capture cursor. Hmm, it's not letting me capture. Oh, there it is. So right over here is where we just long planked over, right? And we landed over here and walked up here. So I think this is the area. If not, I'm completely wrong, but I know that there's a nymph guy in there. He walks around and he has fun. Well, he doesn't walk around, but he appears and you can like push him around. And for those of you who are wondering, maybe that's what you need to put on top of the, um, the little temple thingy. Morgs has tried. <laughs> so, um, right here. So huge shout out to Morgs for picking this guy up, bringing him all the way up to the cherry blossom area and dropping him on top of the, uh, the little pedestal. I don't think it did anything for him, but it's still fun. So that's it. I think that's it for the updates. That's it for the, the glitches. By the way, I never said it was glitch free. I never stated it was glitch free. Ugh. <sighs> let's see that's I think that's it don't forget to follow uh, follow me over there at PAX whenever I'm doing the competition thing it's gonna be this week if you haven't checked out uh, PAX West please do so don't forget to like comment subscribe do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos love you guys very much have a great night we'll talk to you soon <sighs> outro Want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.